On behalf of the bride and groom's families, I want to thank everyone for coming today. We are gathered here before God, family, and friends to witness the holy matrimony of Chad and McKenna. Well, I wish love was an easy song to write Cause I'd have pages worth of words that were not lies Your name would be the melody that's on my tongue Oh, if love was a simple song There are no words that have been written or been sung Chad has been there since day one. And I think we have all, everyone here, been waiting anxiously for this day to finally arrive. My ears have heard But I've cheapened with my tongue To hold the weight Of this thing that we call love Now that you're all are moving an hour and a half away from me, it is now your job to get her coffee and care for her now that I won't be able to be there. No, it's true, but darling, I love you. you by my side There's no harmony or rhymes Just afraid Hi! Hi! Do I have to give him a hug? I now? want a hug. Oh, love, you are worth the fight Cause my songs feel Though not pretty or poetic Perfect in my ways, and I let you down most days. I know it's true, but darling, I love you. This love is alive, it's active, dynamic, and powerful. Cling to it during good times and bad. All marriages have ups and downs. If you will make a habit of returning to your reason, you will find the strength to choose each other in every moment, in every place, and at all times. Chad, repeat after me. I, Chad, take you, McKenna, to be my wife. I, Chad, take you, McKenna, to be my wife. McKenna, repeat after me. I, McKenna, take you, Chad, to be my husband. I, McKenna, take you, Chad, to be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poor. For richer or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I promise to love and cherish you. I promise to love and cherish you. You make us the ride. Ladies and gentlemen, I am extremely honored to officially introduce you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Chad Hoyt.
love, you must both enter your life together with vulnerability. To truly trust, you must, in good faith, allow for freedom and autonomy. To truly respect, you must consciously treat your partner with reverence.